is an initiative that is near and dear to all of our hearts here at First Coast News and First Coast Living. Stuff the bus. Between now and August 3rd, we do need your help collecting school supplies to benefit students and teachers in our local classrooms. Keto Porter is our partner with United Way of Northeast Florida and Teresa Brown is the principal at Southside Estates Elementary School. Welcome to the show. Thank Welcome. You. Thank you. Mr. Porter, I want to kick it off with you. Tell us a little bit about uh, Stuff the Bus and what it means to our community. Yes, yeah, so we have a great partnership with First Coast News, United Way um, of Northeast Florida. We are supporting our full service schools initiative that supports 87 Duval County Public Schools. So we have the ability to, you know, touch about 57,000 students. And this has been a huge initiative for many years. And we're really excited at this year about uh, trying to stuff two buses. So last year we had great <laughs> success in um, providing over 37,000 school supplies to those 87 schools. And this year we have the bold new goal of trying to stuff two buses. So we're trying to wow. actually double the amount that we received on last year. Now, I'm assuming this is not just because you're an overachiever and everybody <laughs> just wants to, you know, achieve more, which we do. But Teresa, I'm assuming that this is because that's the need out there in our schools for our students and our teachers. This is a big need in our community. Um, these are tough economic times. and. Oftentimes our teachers are spending their own money um, trying to ensure that all students are prepared and have the materials that they need to be successful in school. And on average, teachers spend about $400 a year on school supplies. Of their own money. On, of their own money. I have to go back and just call you Miss Brown because it reminds me of school. <laughs> so Miss Brown, what does, uh, how does it feel as someone who is a principal and in the school system to see the community come together and start donating this and show their support for all the students here? It means everything. That means they are a part of Team Duval. So that's how all students will be successful when the school and the community are working together. It makes us one and we're all shooting for the same goal, which is the success for students. So Team Duval. Now we're talking success. Successfully, uh, we, we, we stuffed one bus. How is the United Way of Northeast Florida attaining its goal of stuffing two buses. What's the strategic plan for this? <laughs> the strategic plan, we have um, went out and, and uh, touched bases with our business partners, so the, cor the corporations within um, that supports United Way. Um, this year, we are proud to say that we have over 60 businesses that have um, joined the, the, the Stuff the Bus initiative. In the past, we've had around 40, so we are you know, seeing increased numbers there. And then again, uh, as Ms. Brown said, it's just the community at large. You know, We're asking the community to come out to really support this because, again, it is very important that kids have what they need on the mm -hmm. first day. And then for those teachers to identify kids throughout the school year that may not, may not have the supplies that they need. So to be able to have those, to be able to remedy that right on the spot so that they can achieve you know, great success, I think is, is, is very important. And Ms. Brown, this is going to be going on now through August 3rd. If someone's going to be shopping from now until then and they're running by Publix or running by Walmart, give us a few easy ideas that we can grab and, and go and drop off. Oh, when you're shopping, think about your own child. Pencils, crayons, glue sticks. Um, Composition notebooks, binders, um, sanit hand sanitizer, colorful sticky notes, magic markers. Those are all things that we need for us. So pretty much just go to the school section and rummage through all of it. Yes. I love it. Now yeah. I'm in trouble. I'm the only one who called you Teresa. <laughs> <laughs> but that's nothing new. I'm, I was always the troublemaker in the back well, of the you, classroom. You would be sent to her office. Oh, though, so. now that's I'm right. just like feeling old. Well, Mr. Porter, we have a, we have a new location. Yes, sure. so we're at the Markets of Town Center on Friday, August the 3rd. We'll be there from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. So again, if you're in that area, please stop by any of the local shops to pick up um, those needed supplies. Again, if you're out shopping for your own kids, please pick up those supplies and bring them out on Friday, August the 3rd. And it's going to be a fun day. I was just at the Chick-fil-A, and they're one of yes. your business partners and one of 20, uh, the location I went to, 20 Chick-fil-A locations here in Jacksonville that are participating. And they're going to be out there. They said, oh, they're going to have a big tent and they're going to be That's giving correct. away all great discount coupons. So can you draw a little bit of picture of kind of the excitement that folks are going to be able to participate in on that day? You're yes. not just going to drop it and run. Oh, it's a great day. We have, like I said, vendors, uh, sponsors that are out there. Like I said, we're starting early that morning, but again, there are snacks throughout the day. I understand they're going to be a slurpy machine. Uh, we have, have back helmets <laughs> and all of those things. So it's a great day. Um, and like I said, really excited uh, for the partnership with you guys. And again, the, the community is, is very needed in regards to 
of what we're trying to do and making sure that kids and teachers have what they need to have a successful school year. Set them up for success. So Absolutely. Great. Thank you both for coming on the Thank show. You. And remember, on August 3rd, come to the markets at Town Center, that's near Chipotle, to drop off your donations for Stuff the Bus. There will be two school buses this year. We need it. So stop by and make sure you stuff those buses. They are throwing down the challenge. All right, <laughs> and for more information and a list of those suggested school supplies that you can donate, because maybe you don't have kids that you are preparing for school and you don't know what they need these days, so please visit United Way, N E F L dot org forward slash stuff the bus and you can always go to first guest news and just click on the stuff the bus and you can link right to that list as well thank you